Hello guys and welcome back for more Pokemon Emerald playing. You're probably asking why I am in a Pokemon Center. Because I came to heal my Pokemon, of course. I actually went to train my tail a bit. Because the gym is really hard actually. It's now level 15. And I'm gonna do a thing. That is depositing my other two Pokemons here. Because there's something there. Uh, I'm just gonna see in a while. Okay, it's time for the gym. And now that we're in the gym, I'm just gonna show you what I, what I was talking about. If you go here to the right, there's a double battle. But, because I only have one Pokemon, it's not double anymore. And so, I can win some good experience for my Taylor. Which I actually need, because um, the gym leader is, is tough. Okay, let's just fight down <laughs> the guy on the left really fast. Okay, yeah, a level 13 matchup, matchup. Now that he's down, we can see more um, in the gym. And there are three tra trainers left. There's one and two more. Okay, okay, I'll probably one each KO this matchup. Ugh, that's so easy. Okay, according to my calculations, I'll be level mm, 17. Okay, this guy here is the last trainer. And after I win this battle, my tailor will be level 17. Okay, this guy here is a Makuita. It's the first time we've seen one in this gym. But this guy's Makuita is really weak. The gym leader's Makuita is, is tough. So that's the problem here. Okay, just to ensure that I'm ready, I'm gonna get my other Pokemons in the box. Okay, now that we have our Pokemon back, we can finally challenge Dufort's team leader, Brawly. So, let's get to him. Through here. And here he is, Brawly. Oh, you're Brawly? Oh really? So you wanted to challenge me? Maybe. Who knows? Anyway, Brawly is a tough trainer. If you have a flying... Okay, a flying Pokemon is recommended here. You gotta have a Taylo. Unless your starter Pokemon is well trained. You know what I mean? He puts up a great fight, Brawly. But, okay. All this meta that does it basically is focusing or something. If you just attack him after he does that, he loses focus. And because I didn't kill him, he's going to use a super potion. So I'm just going to take advantage of it and use a potion myself. I don't use super potions, I don't need that. Oops, sorry. Focus, focus, focus. The first two Pokemon uh, aren't really that challenging, but the last one is kind of like Roxanne. The two, uh, the two uh, Geodudes. Weren't really tough, but nose pass. Oh my god, a nose pass. Rock tomb. 
Okay, this Metatite is down. Now for the last Pokemon. Which is level 19. One level higher than my Taylor. Yes, a Makuhita. Were you expecting someone else? Okay, I'll I'll do focus energy. I, I hope this works. I hope I, s I really hope this works. Please. Oh, thank God. Thank God it worked. Really. Tired of it, later, Polly. Whoa, whoa! You, made a little, you made a much bigger splash than I expected. You sump me. Okay, you got me. Take this gym badge. Whoa, and so we get our second badge. Knuckle badge. Sonic badge. A knuckle badge. What? Okay, you're probably going to give me a TM. There you go. Hmm, get in this bulk up. Really good move. Okay, so you're just a M in the Pokenav. Now you can fully see the gym. It's a really beautiful gym. Not. And now, because of that, we can equip HM, HM uh, number I, that I've forgotten. Hmm. Flash. Let me just get Flash. To talk to this guy here. Hey you, it gets awfully dark here. It'll be tough trying to explore. The guy who came by earlier, Steven? I think he was. Okay, and you already use Flash, blah 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 blah, and I have Flash, so I'm gonna give it to you. HM5. It contains Flash. Anyway, since I don't have a Pokemon that can mm, learn Flash, I think. That's right, because I'm not going to ditch my Gravile Flash. It's a useless attack. I'm gonna catch a Pokemon. Okay, and now that we're back with a new Pokemon, we can finally go through that cave. It's a Distox, yeah. It took a while to level him up. But now he has Flash, so we can use it. So, first, because I don't want to fight any wild Pokemons here, I'm gonna use Repel. Go through here and get all the Pokeballs you find. This one contains an escape rope. Okay, so it's pitch dark here. You use flash and there you go. You can see more. The thing here you need a bike to go up. You can see. Okay. This Pokeball contains a Pokeball. Continue going right. Using my repels. And keep going. Through here. And talk to this stone here. To get an Everstone. Which stops your Pokemon from evolving. It's useful. Actually, if you don't want to evolve them. So you don't have to be always pressing the B button. To stop them from evolving. Okay, so this is the end. Ugh. Damn you, Rebel. This is the end of the cave. Just go here and there will be a guy here. Exactly, it's Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Oh, there for me. Yay. Okay, thank you. Uh, I'll give you this DM. Good day, my favorite move. Steel wing. Oh, really? It's the M47. Steel wing. It's a steel move. Oh, really? I know. Could even become champion of the Pokemon League one day. That's what I think. I don't know. Charlotte's Pokemon. Oh, Pokemon. 
There you go. And now it goes away. You could just go through the same place over again, but because we got that escape rope in the beginning, I'm gonna use it, as you can see. Used to escape instantly from a cave or a dungeon. You could use the escape rope and there we go. Back to road uh, 106. 106. And then do for town. Before I end this episode though, I'm gonna talk to this fisherman here. If you tell him you like to fish, he'll give you an old rod, which lets you fish for mm, Pokemon. In this case, you can only get Magikarps, I think. But I'll see that in the next episode. So see you guys later.